never noticed that before. What? That ancient stone carving of the gargoyle. Wasn't there yesterday. Huh? It's the real thing, Virgil. That's how gargoyles sleep during the day, perched on the corners of... Shouldn't we be quiet? Waking a sleeping gargoyle isn't the big problem. What problem? Help! That problem. Morning, Mr. Mayor. Nice day for, um... Surfing? What a surprise! Look who's here! Brady Plunkett! Some sort of monster must be responsible for this, and you better figure it out before I have your monster operation transferred to another planet! Where does that mirror get off? Always blaming the monsters for everything. He's right. I knew it. Those scratching, drooling monsters are behind all the problems in Ravenville. That's not what I meant. Me neither. What is it we mean again? Gargoyles are only concrete carvings during the day. At night, they peel off their outer layer and fly around. <laughs> what time's the sun set today? During the day, they protect their skin from the sun. Turns out gargoyles are highly allergic to the sun's rays. We going now? Question is, where's the gargoyle finding its special stone coat? Lead! That explains it. Explains what? Lead comes from only one place in Ravenville. Pencils? It's used to coat the miles of water pipes below town. What are your plans for tonight? Nightmares, mostly filled with flying gargoyles. Cancel that. I'm about to make those dreams come true. Yuck! I said nightmares. It's gone. Problem solved. Weren't you listening? Brady told us a gargoyle never nests in the same place twice. But that's great, don't you see? Maybe it's over in Crowtown or, or Storm Village or, or, or... It's in the sewer. Let's go! Funny you should mention sewer. I've got a toilet needs on block again. It can wait! I just love it down here. Cold, dark, clammy. What's not to like? There! Where? What? Burst water pipe. Wow! It tore huge strips of metal right off! To eat? To wear! The gargoyle won't leave until he's exhausted Ravenville's entire supply of lead. And that's a good thing? Every time the monster tears up a lead pipe, it causes a flood! Bad. I got it. We've got to get that gargoyle out of town before it turns Ravenville into a lake. Question is, where will the gargoyle strike next? Was that your monster tracking device? Uh-huh. Then, let's say we call it a night. I'll be the bait. Here, monster. Here, boy. Come out, come out, wherever you are. Gargoyle! Gargoyle? I didn't say nothing. Hey, maybe the gargoyle really has left town. We'll know for sure first thing tomorrow morning. Virgil! Don't open that door! Morning, Principal Poop Deck. Does all this water damage mean that school's canceled? School is canceled? Hey, school's canceled! Yeah. 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 I'm this close, this close to having you deported, Brady Plunkett! I think you better move over, Mr. Mayor. Pressure's building up behind you. What did you say? How dare you try and order me? Hey, did you hear? No school today. Let's go. We have a lot of work to do and not a lot of time. Homework?
Nothing can move a gargoyle during the day. We have to do our thing at night. We're gonna catch him! Nope. Chase him away. Here's the plan. We've gotta coat the water pipes all over town. With what? Something easy to apply and remove. Something that'll fool a gargoyle into thinking it's what he needs to protect himself from the sun. Something we could get our hands on. Of course! Oops. The gargoyle will tear the outer layer of tinfoil from the water pipes and leave the lead untouched. Tinfoil will work perfectly for us, but it won't protect the gargoyle from the sun. He'll be convinced he has to leave town. All we have to do now is get our hands on as much of the stuff as possible. Peanut butter? Tinfoil! Oh. We've got two problems. This isn't nearly enough tinfoil to wrap all the pipes in Ravenville, and we have no idea where the gargoyle will strike next. What's the second problem? This leaves me no choice. Walkie-talkies! We're gonna play hide-and-seek? I'm gonna ride the gargoyle tonight. That's insane! Well, one of us has to do it. Wear a sweater. It's supposed to be chilly tonight. Relax. The gargoyle is so focused it won't even notice something as small and insignificant as me. I'll let you know where he's going. It'll be your job to get there before we do and get those pipes wrapped in tinfoil. You can count on me, Brady. I agree. You can count on her. <clears throat> you can count on us. You'll also each get your own monster pack. You never know what you might need or when. Take it easy, will you, big guy? I've never flown before. Try and stick together, okay? Got your back, dude. Remember, keep in touch. Oh. What are you waiting for? Wait up. I can't see a thing. That's why Brady gave us each night goggles. There, that's better. I thought it would be. The fire station! The haunted house! The cemetery! Look! Amber! Amber! Thank goodness you're here! Yeah? <laughs> Compressed laughing powder? <laughs> Ouch! <laughs> Sun rises in 15 minutes. He only has time to reach the monster shop. I'm right under it. <laughs> I gotta go help those kooks out. <laughs> Wait a minute. Is that Virgil wrapped up in the tin foil? That would be so cool! <laughs> I guess we'll never see the gargoyle again! Yeah... Oh, I bet he'll be miles away before he finds any lead. Water pipes are destroyed all over town! Someone's gonna pay for the repairs, Brady Plunkett! I'll do everything I can to help, Mr. Mayor! 
This town's had enough of your kind of help. The Ravenville Waterworks Department will do all the repair work. There's an emergency up at the dam on the hill. The water dam is developing cracks. The dam? What's it made of? Lead! 